With Battle of the Ages, we wanted to create an environment, a team environment, where we were testing many facets of fitness with the element of having to bring multiple generations into the competition. We believe that people should compete because it gets you outside your comfort zone. When you step out there into the competitive environment, it tests you. You bump up against that mental capacity. You find yourself in a position every time you compete on, can I go harder? Can I go faster? Anytime that you test your outer limits, you're always gonna come away better. Fitness is definitely for everyone. That was our, a really big objective for us, was to draw in the younger athlete and even the master's athlete that was getting back into the world of sport and wanting to develop their level of fitness. And that combination just created a camaraderie where you know the guys that have been in it for a long time were able to pour into the younger guys, the new guys that had never competed before. Four or five teams that had father-sons on the team guys in their 50s, some elite athletes in there competing. In our world, in the CrossFit world, fitness is really about having fun. You know, everybody wants to win, but at the same time, if you're not having fun while you're trying to win, then what's the point? Battle of the Ages was a huge success for a lot of reasons. We had great support from our volunteers, our judges, our sponsors. Everybody worked well together as a team. Stacy and I sincerely want to thank everyone from the bottom of our heart for the hard work that they put in. There's just no way that we could have accomplished this without all these people working together. There's 25 different boxes or so represented. There was, there was teams from all over Alabama, Tennessee, Georgia, Mississippi, Florida. Bringing the generations together is really a special thing. So guys, stay tuned. Look out for the next one. Three, two, one, go. Oh,